to get interrupted by an NPC, and he goes like, what the hell, and some guy runs in. But he went like, what the hell, and then a guy literally spawned inside the table the king's sitting at. <laughs> they ran out of the table, ran right around in circles for a bit. That's quite a what the hell situation. Yeah, I agree with you, King. What the hell? Just gonna fix some things up, and then we'll be back to the game. These guys are like, come to the Silver Rush for your energy weapon needs. I'm like, nah, man. I go to the big MT for that. And we are back up and running. Sorry about that. This guy's like, pull a weapon and we will fire, so I had to see if he was lying. He wasn't. And now he's paced? No. I, I'd like quick save first. Okay, see. Start off with that. Start off with some unarmed. There will be some fast travel because we're gonna try and get back up to where we were in a reasonable amount of time. Oh god. Fantastic shows up again later. Fantastic is too fantastic to be kept down. because he's just too fantastic. Oh wait, I answered it right there.
Want to say hi to Stockholm. Welcome to Megaton. Hey, Nick B, thanks for sticking around. Or coming back, either way. Welcome to Megaton. Friendliest town around. Welcome to Megaton, friendliest town around. The more time I spend talking to you, the less I'm spending watching for raiders. How the right, hell did you get to... up here anyway? <laughs> Go have to talk to Stockholm. One of the stripped securitrons the at the I door is just like staring at the wall to his right. That wall. No one's getting through that wall. Another newcomer. Name's Lucas. Si Let's see what Myra has in store. I'm still not idolized with the NCR, Jesus Christ. Do they know how many Legion I've killed? That's not... No, probably not. I guess that would really make a difference if they did. Good hunting! Next we need to deal with Walter. Yeah, what is it? I also need to see Myra about something. Oh. Good hunting! Let's go through these motions really quickly. We'll save Megaton, we'll make it better. Our 
released from the pain and hardships of this I feel like it's dumb you can't be a ranger. Yay, your suffering oh yeah, there's a lot of things that you should be able to do. In the original Fallout, you could become a member of the Brotherhood of Steel. Actually, you can... In the Fallout 2, you can be a ranger. I forget, did New Vegas, do they let you become a member of the Brotherhood of Steel, or do they just, like, train you and keep you as, like, a monkey? Or treat oh, you I am actually a member of the Brotherhood of Steel. Why is that the same thing? Talk about NCI Rangers, not Brotherhood of Steel. Well, um... I don't know. In Fallout 3, you can become a Ranger. What? There's no NCI in Fallout 3. Yeah, they're still Rangers, though. Syndra Collar being a ranger. Riley's a ranger. Them's different. That's like a merc group. What do you need? And you can also become a regulator. If you have really high karma. Yeah? What is it? Time to um, go see Moriarty about, or Burke about trying to get him out of some caps, screw some caps out of him. Yeah, follow it too. You get to join them. So you should totally be able to in New Vegas. Totally. So they're definitely a very similar in play style video game. Yep. Yep. Uh... So I'm really sad that no one comments on my really dumb eyeglass hat. The Super Halo. It's no big deal. My, my. The Atomic Valence tri radi Oscillator. I do have. You'll re. Is that the. I told you, Gob, it ain't the raid. Also, Gunderson's son totally got murdered in Eaton. I haven't done this in a while, but I have a suspicion I they think ate he was him. About to be eaten, and you can see oh. him. Can I eat him? Maybe. <laughs> no, I don't have the cannibal perk, so I can't. Uh... That's my. What about it? Oh, don't worry, I'm not blowing it up again. I'm just um, playing out the, the, the little scenario. He said, Jesus, give me. Let's. Yeah, other weird thing about um, World War of Blues, I came across a bunch of Securitron Mark like sixes and five. And had all their rocket pods working. What? It's fucking terrifying. But I'm pretty sure those shouldn't exist. Especially seeing as. Big MT didn't make them. In fact, they're pissed off at Rabico for being better than them. Yeah, that's the plan. Yeah. Yeah. And they're also jealous of them being able to do, like, vault experiments and shit. Like, man, why can't we get these sweet towns to experiment on people with? Fuck! Got something on your mind. It's a very good thing they didn't, because they're somehow worse. Explain. Oh my god! I don't know if they're really worse. No, 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 they're the more incompetent, not really worse. In this oh, yeah. They did a pretty good job at fucking the Sierra Madre, though. Hmm. Yeah. Turns out none of them were actually experiments, they're all just really fucking stupidly designed. No, they, they, they mentioned they did that. Yeah. Like the know, fart it's... cloud and the shitty nice. suits and everything.
My favorite pastime in this video game is slamming doors in NPCs' faces. That's my eye. Especially Veronica. It's like, oh, you wanted to follow me through the store? No. <sighs> oh, or Boo, because he's so scowly. You looking for the mayor? Yeah. Or the sheriff? Lucas Sims didn't comment on the fact that I saved his life from Burke. I did it too early. Oh well, it doesn't matter. It's a pretty good choice, getting his gun. You can also then get into his house, um, for free. Go to Hoover Dam! Whatever she's gonna tell me to go assassinate Caesar. I need to get into his house at some point. That's totally something I'm gonna do, just... Not yet. Now how are you gonna do it? Are you gonna... Help him with his tumor? I probably will. And then shoot him in the face. Oh. I was gonna say you could help it by blowing it right out of his head, but you probably don't have the lungs to do that. No, I actually have ten strength and ten endurance during the day, so maybe I do. Yeah, I'm saving Lucas Sims because if I, if I squeeze let him his die. head really hard, it'll pop right. Probably. I'll be damned. Or else Veronica to remove it with her power fist. To too. Hell, why don't you move in? Here's the key and the deed to an empty house. Consider yourself a Megaton citizen. Oh, and talk with Moira at Craterside Supply. She's got random odds and ends you might be able to spruce the place up with. So the game still thinks I'm in the strip because it's playing like all the ambient noises of people talking. Yeah. I actually have noticed that in like places that are distinctly not populated at all when I was in New Vegas. Like I'm on the road near the Hoover Dam right now. There is me and one sentry behind some sandbag. He's talking to himself and re responding to himself. And it's also a barking dog. Yep, that too. He's working on his like act for the strip. It appears you've been wounded, madam. May I suggest you? I was considering putting the gun back, and then um, you know. Uh, what should we call it? Putting the gun back and then, um, just going without a weapon that's range, but no. No, I'm not going to do that. Where is, what's her face? Now I know I've never I have Fallout 3. You have to have Fallout 3 to um, do this. Um, question of why not just play Fallout 3? I like the idea of being able to go back and forth between the two areas and things that are different because of it. I like the Fallout New Vegas engine changes that they made from 3 to New Vegas that are those subtly subtly different enjoy for one hardcore mode is built in don't need to get a mod for that
Wrong place. Oh. Hi. Now. Okay. A little Brahmin milk, a couple magnets, and maybe a few happy thoughts. Well, you're alive! Oh, that's the good news. But there was a little side effect. Here. And that'll... Oh yeah, there's um, minor changes. Um, where is this thing? That's what I'm for. Um, for the most part, books have been replaced with magazines because you have the books from Fallout New Vegas that you're going to get eventually. Um, that's one thing. Um, they've been, they added like plants from New Vegas into Fallout 3 so that you can get food and stuff like that from just the world. But it's, it's more like... Um, in Fallout um, 3, you, you wouldn't get a 10mm pistol with a silencer, you'd have a silenced 10mm pistol. In this game, it's a mod that you can slap onto any 10mm pistol, and you can get different mods for different weapons. That's one of the things that they added for um, New Vegas, was weapon modification. The repair system works differently, um, and the perk rate is, uh, instead of getting a perk every level, you get a perk every two levels. Which is a balance issue with Fallout 3. Um, that's a bit difficult, but not entirely difficult. Not too bad, rather. Not too bad. Um, so yeah, there's things about it that are good. It is basically just Fallout 3, though. This mod, that is. Um, but the gameplay changes are worthwhile. Guns, there are now guns, and then there's energy weapons instead of having like small guns, big guns, and then all those different things. It just changes to the structure of the game. Let's see, we have the Rivet City bobblehead. I got the brass knuckles from Moira a little while back. I went to her shop and bought them. <laughs> because she has a random stock, and this time I got lucky, and she had brass knuckles. I'll need to get spike, spike knuckles later, but for now, brass will do. What's our random encounter here today? Oh god. Raiders and more raiders. Fun. That encounter with the radiators are beating on the other raider. Teaching him to endure pain, I guess. And yeah. Nail board with some money. He actually came right up to me. Nope. Alright, he's dealt with. A hunting rifle. Well, what do you know? Right off the bat, I got something good. Got my 
308 rifle right off the bat. There it is, there's the one that's inside the ground. Yeah, the helmet is a bit ridiculous. Oh wow, I have exactly the amount of caps that he, or exactly the amount for his caps, all of his caps. Yeah. Yeah, that helmet. That fucking helmet. It's so big and derpy. Let's go punch some raiders. Some more raiders. And then we'll punch our way into Rivet City. Well, we'll punch our way to River City. We'll punch our way to River City. River City doesn't need any punching. We're not killing more trade hubs. We're not doing that. Oh my god, that was awful. That was almost a death. Wow, 
got sloppy. He grenaded me right in the fucking foot. I'm gonna get addicted all over the, uh, so many times, but not the stim packs. Mm, not yet. Guys, just go to a doctor and get your addiction cured. If you don't die along the way, oh my god, that was so close. You two sentry bot. Why is there a brute here already? This isn't good. A potato flew around, 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 it's gonna call it around. Just fisting some mutants. On my way to Rivet City again, because playing up Megaton was a terrible, terrible idea. Especially the things that followed it.
Is this really bad, that bad that I can't even hit the thing? I'm aiming center mass. Looks like center mass isn't quite as center mass as I had thought. Mr. Mutant, you're in the floor. That is silly. You're being silly. You should stop that. Fast travel point for Uber Dam is super dumb. It dumps you right in front of the offices and like the main dam build. But to actually get the point, you have to go like halfway up the dam. Hilarious. Yeah. So like the first time I came here to do stuff, I didn't get the point and didn't even know. So I said fuck that and worked to the closest point and then just no clip through a mountain. dealt with. I can't wait to get Super Slam again. Uh, it's so good. Now let's see if we can loot this, this dummy underneath the floor. Command for something that's rather trivial. I would pull his arm, but um, <laughs> it's not really an option. Quest just popped up. Hey, man, if you have spies everywhere, keep working against the Legion, they'll mark you an enemy. I'm pretty sure that's why they're sending assassins against me right now. I don't think you need to give me a quest. Yeah. The problem is that though that wall doesn't look solid, it looks very like see-through, shoot up, shoot through. Um, not there at all. It's so just like looking around there. on my map. And there's like a little one unexplored place around me. It's like, oh, I'll go over there. I look at Casador now. Yeah, no, that's that's gonna stay. That's gonna stay unexplored. Undiscovered. Okay, thanks. Cause fuck that. Fuck this grenade throwing super mutant. Did I miss? Oh no, I think I punched him right in the nail board.
still need to do with those super mutants afterwards. But for now, I'm just gonna go to Rivet City and do some trading. We we're gonna finally go confront Benny. No, but I confront. Don't do it. Murder. The beginning of the end. But literally. Matthew Perry. I well, yeah. But I don't have to like continue doing quests if I go confront Ben. Make sure you kill him with the right weapon, though. My sniper rifle. I think it's a golf club or something. There's like a, a achievement or a challenge for like killing him with a specific thing. Oh. I see. Check the challenges. Ding, ding. Eh. Bring in ding ding and enjoy sniper rifle from three feet away Welcome in your sleeping room. City. If I, I, can I confront him and then kill him afterward? Like, if I do that conversation, does he flee so. or does he just? Uh, no, he. I don't think he just disappears from the world. Right there. State it's my plan. Is confront him in the casino, yell at him a bit, and then kill him while he's sleeping. I think he he flees the casino. He like invites you up to. Yeah, but I don't think he like vanishes completely. I'm not too sure though. He might run to Caesar's. Maybe. Because some of the NPCs do that. Apparently, it's a golf club because of Bioshock. Turns out, if you activate the defense system, the Helios one, kill all the NCR, the Legion will move in. And Fantastic is still there, but like clad in Legion armor. And like, still <laughs> the whole thing. And he's just like, yeah, the Legion's a new thing. Uh, <laughs> fucking fantastic. He's just fantastic. ridiculous. I need to see pictures of him at Legion armor. To the internet. I'm not sure how he manages. How he, like, convinces them to let him live. He is fantastic, that's how. For the most advanced science, scientific center in the capital wasteland, I find your... The picture he keeps his sunglasses, though. <laughs> yeah, he does. I wish he was wearing one of those silly wolf hats. This is Hey Man, when in Rome. <laughs> <laughs> so dumb. No, it's so fantastic. Yeah. yeah. Eh? Yeah, it is. Eh? God damn, I love the tongue. I don't even pay attention to what I'm shooting at. I'm just holding down left click and like moving the mouse around and everything's done. You're playing on very hard? No. Because if I was playing on very hard, that one giant rad scorpion would have just killed me. <laughs> Probably. They're not that bad. It really isn't that bad. And also. Oh my god, would I need so many more bullets to use the Thompson very hard. That's secure for a reason. That's probably true. It's got a 50 shot mag and like the fastest refire rate I've seen so far. And the ammo's pretty rare because it's DLC ammo. I like, totally forgot to take include C finder. So we're running at one percent efficiency, and I guess that just isn't good enough for some assholes. He is the worst. <laughs> one percent efficiency just isn't good enough for some assholes. Do you have no, a man, degree in theoretical exactly physics? I have a theoretical degree in physics. They got what they deserved. <laughs> I 
I think we're gonna try using this Tesla beaten prototype I have. It appears to be a unique like how Tesla can. There is literally no side effect to killing him. You can just like slaughter him and no one cares. You don't lose any like rep for anyone. <laughs> or, nor do you really? lose karma, apparently. I'm yeah. gonna go kill him now. He's just Thanks like for some know. random random guy. Why would you kill Fantastic? He does if you don't kill him though, he shows up again. As yet another in yet another place he should not be. Oh god, I accidentally like activated a weapon binding ritual. I don't even know what that <laughs> does, but my guy went like, Ooh, you, should, oh, you should leave him alive. Like a thing pop. You should leave him alive so you can see when he ascends. What? He ascends? Ascends to godhood. Oh god. I don't remember this DLC. Love DLC. Just fantastic. Oh, it turns out my unique Tesla cannon is just completely better in every way than the normal Tesla cannon. Sounds about right. Oh man. It turns out if, like, when Fantastic switches sides to the Legion, he actually ends up killing Ignatio Rivas. He's like the one that actually kills that scientist dude in the, uh, the thing. But he murders the follower person? Yep. in Rome. <laughs> what in Rome murdered that? That's what that's what he's saying in response to I'm pretty sure. I oh my god, I see, wow. Yeah. It's fucked up. What? What does he do? He murders the follower like scientist that's alongside him. Oh god. But he shows up somewhere other than Helios 1? Oh my god, I'm looking forward to that. No, oh, he stays there. Like, if you kill everyone, the Legion takes it. Yeah, 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 but... He said shows up later. That's what Dan said, either. Wait, oh. Oh. Yeah. No end to the fantastic. They're time to. Oh no, they probably don't spawn anymore because I like, took the prison back. They're all powder gangers. Like I always. Yeah, use powder gangers to test my weapon. Oh no, they're still. Don't worry, there's no shortage of, shortage of power, powder gangers anywhere, anytime. They're just always there. They call me Shrapnel. They actually, like, grow as spars in the ground. They're just there. Which... I like how he actually changes. He just straight up changes side. His faction actually changes. <laughs> that is so good. I just wish they had put in, like, a dialogue for, like, what he said to like make them not kill him. Yeah. Like how he joined the it's Legion. An explanation for why he's not dead yeah. as hell. It's just because of like the previous dialogue was fantastic as well. Of course it was. He's Mr. Fantastic. Yeah. Time to answer the question of do these death claws respawn? Probably. I'm in the quarry right now. I don't think they respawn in the quarry. Oh, probably not those ones. But other ones, I, I believe so. Did the quest. Let me introduce myself. I am my I need something scary to test my death cannon on. 
can't get much scarier than Death Claws. I would go with Kazador, but it's not that they have health, it's just that they're bullshit. Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't look like these respawn. So, to my Brotherhood bunk. Dan, where's the Brotherhood safe house? Good enough. The New Vegas north half of the map. So northeast quadrant. You saw like the, um, the guard fall. Problem is, is if you go from if you go from the west to east to get. Oh, there, I already have it. I just couldn't find the. Oh, I see. Okay. What can I say? Like it's death claws. Just as far as the. Oh, that's that's see. that's why I'm here. I'm here to fight death claws. Go for it then. Enjoy. Be merry. Gotta test out the Tesla cannon somehow. Playing on very hard, so like they're a little bit more strong in my, uh, my game, but they like both the mother and the alpha one hit me basically in full power armor. Yeah, they did that to me too. I had to cheese them. God damn it, Seagrave. Freaking Goss rifled them from max distance. I just found a piece of equipment that they couldn't get to me. I didn't even do that, I just used distance. The mother actually made it like to me, but I managed to like try beam her enough time on the way. She runs like so quickly. It looks like a bug, but like she runs ridiculously fast. The animation. Oh just, yeah, like, it's broken. terrifying. Yeah, I didn't have ghosts or anything when I killed them. I used um just a regular sniper rifle. Oh, that would be really difficult. So I had to use terrain to cheat. I completely forgot about, um, oh god, that name, I still forget the name. Sloan? Sloan, yeah. Didn't even remember that it existed. I went back there and got like the like, 80 experience, it's worth. No way. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so it'll one hit the young death claws, but I want to find something that isn't a young death claw. There's tons of adults in the north side of the room. Most of the ones in that There's... corner are blind for some reason. There's adult ones there too, but... Yeah, it's weird. At least in my game they were. It doesn't make them any worse. I don't understand why they're even blind. Because they can smell your fear. <laughs> Maybe. I got jumped when I was out there. I didn't know I wasn't expecting them at all. I was like talking to Mike or something. Then I got like, like jumped by two of them. It's terrifying. The worst thing, the worst day when like the thing coming over the hill happens to be a death claw. Yeah, they are Two blind death claws. Adult. Yeah, it's weird. Like I only thought there was the one blind death claw now in pass. Turns out it's not true. Trouble in this area. I'm just like duck walking around with this my giant doom cannon and my stealth suit. We've got. I think it's hilariously big. Still sir? No, the Doom Cannon. Oh. Another satisfied. It's like a stall. Time to go kill some mutants. I wonder if, like, Death Claws would have trouble standing up to a fat man. Not on very. Honestly, uh, not on normal, but on very the hard. The fat man is so underwhelming. Which has more radius than that. Maybe I never you could sneak explosives. attack critical them with the fat man. Thinking like a Call of Duty character. <laughs> be like, like using grenades for once. It would actually be kinda cool. I'll make sure to grab like the commando perk then. That shit's so I mean like if I were to, yeah I would. But like, I... I have to oh, you can grab it anyways basically actually. basically done. Cause it affects all rifle stat. I don't use vats really on this character though. Oh, it's not, like, vats, it's just, it makes all your shit better. Oh, you're talking about, oh, uh, there's a, um, I think Commando's the one that's, like, two-handed vat accuracy. I think I, think I know oh, you're talking about, though, there's a, um, 
It's the one that makes like assault rifles and grenades and like yeah, it's just assault rifles like, better. It's like cowboy, yeah. but for like soldiery stuff. Exactly. Grunt maybe. I think yeah, yeah it might be grunt. I'm about well, to get laser commander on my game actually. My super mutants aren't here again. Like the first yeah, actual good. energy weapon. It's perk I have. I'm gonna reload the game. The game's starting to like bug out when I um load menus and stuff like that. Just took fucking forever. Would be great is if when I loaded in, the super mutants loaded in, and I was like, oh, yep, there we go. I figured this might happen. I was kind of worried this would happen actually, but it's fine. We're okay. We're good. We can recover this. Okay, maybe we can't. Oh god. Bad guys dealt with. According to my stealth suit. Stop that, you son of a bitch! <laughs> it's when Legionnaire had C4, but no way to detonate the C4. I'm currently not on a quest. I'm currently getting killed by super mutants. Oh god, I didn't realize that he would just keep grabbing more grenades from different packs and keep using them. Saving that one person. Oh my god, my body is self destroyed by that. The next thing I'm oh, by doing. The, way, the people who chill in safe houses aren't actually tied to any faction. What? Because I got really? bored and I like unlocked the Legion safe house to see what was in there and I just like talked with the guy in shop and then left and then locked the door. <laughs> it might only be the Legion. They don't, probably don't give a shit. Oh, they should give a shit. Nah. I want to see if like they'd yell at me for being somewhere I shouldn't, anything like that. No, they just don't care. Like, yeah, I'll repair your stuff. Yeah, you can take whatever's in. Vets, assistant shots, like damage weapons more. That's actually is that not that's not true in uh, New Vegas either? Or 
anymore? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm, I'm only looking at 12, 3. I'm on the quest to repair my body. That is utterly broken from those grenades. It's just an article I'm looking Oh my god. My body. My body. Stop by the market and see if my armor needs repairing, which it probably should after that. Because I just went oh, flopping yeah. around. I remember Mike David, like, just freaking getting all of the companions together in Fallout 3. All of, like, the quest specific ones, where, like, they follow you for until the quest is complete. You just get them and never leave the. like, never complete the quest. Oh. That's the thing, yeah. Don't know you. I think for you doing that. I may have. I don't entirely remember. Oh, that is so annoying. It's doing it again? I wonder if it's going to have an issue. Why, like, float out of the cell and just crash or something? Security officer know if you see anything out of the ordinary. By the way, I need to go to a medic. Like, right now. You're in the Revit City Clinic. Facial surgery is way too dangerous to try. Need... Sure thing. Oh, please stop doing that game. Come on. Doctor. Lucky I happened along, but first let's discuss my fee. 100 caps ought to cover it. This won't hurt a bit. Nah, just kidding. It will probably hurt a lot. Hold still. Think I'll go get some lunch. Why do you only take 75? <laughs> oh my god. This game is bugging out hard. Yes, I can feel better. India, sure. at least That's follow the three in their country. Need anything else? Well, Microsoft in that country didn't release it. Because, uh, the, like, the word Brahmin, the, like, caste are called Brahmin, and that's, like, the highest Hindu caste. Ooh. It's, like, the same name, same word. Yeah, that's probably a no no. Probably where they got that word, but I don't know. Because the cows being sacred, they probably like cows. Hinduism. How would you come up with that word? Yeah. Shit's over. Go get some rest. For now, I'm not really... I should go do a quest, actually. 
I'm gonna get some combat armor right now. I'm pretty sure at least. I could be wrong. This might be a death sentence. Probably not, because honestly, the Talon Company is so incompetent compared to regulators. Been rather busy lately. You're not telling company. Investigating, or do you have some kind of? Well, if that's true, then the first thing you need to do is halt your investigation. No more questions. No more searching. The movement I'm involved with, we help his kind escape their Commonwealth-imposed slavery. We help them disappear. You understand? You really want help? Take this. It's an internal no, not yet. the very android you're searching for. Don't ask how I obtained it. Present it to Dr. Zimmer in Rivet City. Tell him the android is dead and that was on the corpse. Do that. Just understand that this android is now, for all intents and purposes, a man. But even if he's not, even if he's a machine, he's capable of rational. This person, and he is a person, deserves a chance at freedom. Please. You know what you need to do. Let's try that again. Let's see if we get to the talent company. If not, that's fine. Huh. No talent company. What do you know? Don't you have a component to deliver? I'm gonna head over to the Super Duper Mart and actually do the Wasteland Survival Guide bit. Actually, no, 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 no. I'm going to do something probably pretty boring. But I'm going to go back to Mega Dun. I'm going to head back to Rivet City. And I'm going to go to Mojave. The Mojave. The blah, 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 blah. Mojave. Welcome home, madam. Oh, I didn't know Fallout New Vegas was actually, like, produced by, or, like, the project was led by Jay Sawyer. Oh, now you do. That's cool. What an asshole. What an asshole. I have no idea how, who Jay Sawyer is as a person. I cannot comment on whether or not he's an asshole. He's one of the lead designers of, like, apparently Jay Sawyer is one of the lead designers of Van Buren, but he, that game never came out, so yeah, I don't really know what that gives him. Oh, he worked at Black Isle, though, for like four years. No, I haven't done the book quest yet. So he was lead designer of Icewind Dale 2. Anyway, shape or form. Oh, cool. Well, I've, okay, I've done, depending on which book you're, if you're talking about the survival guy, then I've well, done, he's had like, a horrible past in terms of game releases. Just the I mean, rad He worked on Baldur's Gate 3 as well. Oof. Lead designer of Baldur's Gate 3, which never came out. And then, lead designer of Fallout 3, Black Isles Fallout 3, which never came out.
So what you're saying is, is that he kills things. That later than things back up, I guess. He also, in 2005, he joined some other kind of company to work on Gauntlet. Like a Gauntlet game. A Gauntlet game. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> And that didn't come out until uh, what year? He left in the same year, actually. Wait, what? No. Oh, I see. No, he got there in 2003 and left in 2005. Right? And then he ended up at Obsidian, where he worked on Neverwinter Nights 2, which is a travesty. Oh, it's not that bad. <laughs> and then he was the project director and lead designer of Aliens Crucible, the cancelled RPG based on the Alien film franchise. You don't have a lot of, uh... <laughs> he's just, you. It's just... No, I'm just saying he... he it's just funny because, like, his, every project is cancelled by the by the, the publisher, like, the... the over... cut the company above him, you know? It's not, like, his fault, necessarily. Yeah. Just like everything is just like we cancelled. It's like playing um, Game Dev Tycoon, but instead of hitting release at the end of the process, you just hit trash game. It's basically what's happened to him just over and over. God, Jay Sawyer wrote and performed several of the songs for Fallout New Vegas. What? Apparently. Oh god, he actually sang in them. No, really? There's no way. What? Performed, adapted, performed by Jay Sawyer. Designing. It's pretty intense. I mean, that's dedication right there. Cobwebs and rainbows, home on the wastes, New Vegas Valley and the streets of New Vena. I don't recognize them by name, but I'm sure they're just like on the radio. So you are playing the correct version of Fallout New Vegas, I guess. So you're saying no, no. Um, I mean you can't like control the whole team, right? He's not like yeah. He's like one of the, the lead designers, but he's not. Doesn't have like a say. Doesn't have like. He's not a dictator. He he would he could be. Things were right yeah. in the world. Yeah. <laughs> I like the idea of ammo having weight, but that's like. Thing that has to happen in the game. I understand that for most people it's really like just a huge ball like just too annoying. But like it really does add to the whole I can only have this much stuff with me. I have to actually conserve ammo. Provided like the enemies I'm killing don't just keep dropping it. What they really do need to do though is make it so that enemies have limited ammo too. Because that was the thing they did in like the original Fallouts. They ran out of ammo and they that did, just yeah. started running up to you to beat the Very traffic. Very quickly at some time. But yeah. Which is pretty funny. Sometimes the enemy's guns would just explode and hurt them and then just like they would just run up to you and try punching you in the face. Really, like, how hard would that be? They did it back with like the shittiest engine. It's just that Bethesda's engine, um, by default, gets every enemy that has like, a range weapon. 
range. No, not even their engine. I'm saying it's not even their engine. It's just like that's their default design Probably choice. Probably track their ammo. Yeah. It's like if they have this ammo, they equip it, and then like they don't care. They have inventories, so we could very easily just track that. You don't have to track like every specific inventory at any time. They could just be like what you're. The Kaiser has marked you for death. The conversation ended, and he got hit by Archimedes. I thought Archimedes was in that pinpoint. That it's a pretty zero. pinpoint. Oh, oh, what? Are you kidding? Accurate. It's just like you click and then there's like three little like lasers that hone in on something. Oh god, it's bug. It's giant ion cannon. So it didn't actually go off because the conversation broke. It. <laughs> but now like the the aiming thing keeps happening over and over. Well, I mean, it's like the beam. I thought the beam was like pretty large, and that like using it too close to something could be dangerous. Well, yeah, but I don't really care at this point. Like, it's right. not really a concern. I do have six hundred and forty health. Wow! In the German version of Vegas, there's no gore. I didn't even play this game with no gore. What does that look like? Like things just wouldn't jib ever. What about like super mutants and their whole like oh, area, everything that they do, their whole shtick? I don't know. Your shtick. How dare you, sir? God, it's ridiculous. That not only in the Japanese version, not only did they remove Megaton's detonation, they also renamed the Fat Man to Nuka Launcher. Yep. Because. Fat man, that's just retarded. Just the bomb. Sure that wasn't yeah. like, yeah, it's the name of the bomb they used, but like, good lord. Vegetarians like for me, I guess. Instead of core bags, they have cabbage bags. This is the dumbest wiki line. Fallout New Vegas was officially banned in the United Arab Emirates, but the ban was repealed later, as it did not contain much violence after a test run was made. What? Just so many questions. <laughs> so, like, the government... ...banned the game because they thought it was going to be too violent? Despite having a rating system? Australia should have banned Fallout 3 because of the drugs. Yeah, well that was because of their, I think the names, like, probably like one of the slang names of the regular drugs were a real slang term for a drug in uh, Australia. Something like that. I'm guessing that's what happened. They just renamed the drugs and released it. Yeah, we, we already talked about the, um, Brahmin thing. and they've been a lot of things. Probably should have just taken the damage that I have into Underworld and gotten the doctor to fix me up.
That's not good. The glitching out of whatever that was that was stretching across the screen. What is going on with my game? City. One day I mean to visit him and chat. Can you pay me? You came back. I should see if she has any good weapons, aka spike knuckles. She does. Score. at your You haven't heard? I'm the f some so pity. I think I now, hopefully. Probably have to find my way through a few mutants though. I will save Riley's Rangers, I just have a certain specific objective on my mind. I'm gonna get to New Vegas and do all that stupid shit that I do. I still set up.
puts those mutants down. Time to go see Winthrop again, then then the doctor. Underworld been treating you so okay. Yes, what is it now? I think Should get me ready for the next batch of super mutants. And we're all done. They're inevitably going to tear my face off. Oh no. Oh, super mutant. Hopefully not one of those super mutants. Not until I have super slam. I mean, I don't know what I'd do if I ran into a super mutant. Doing big time at level 8 or plus is not bad, because, like, I can just punch the shit out of them. Once I get Super Slam, it's so good. It's so good. Like, level 10, I'm set for a while. I don't even know what perks I really need after level 10. Fall for it every time. And I gotta keep falling for it. Because they're dumb.
That's gonna go well. You're inside a wall, mutant. Dramatic zoo. Did you break free of the wall? Or are you a different mutant? for drugs. I guess he did break free. Good for him. I'll head back one more time. Get as many stimpacks as I can. Where's Winthrop? I need to see him about some more repairs. Let's see in his house or his closet, I guess. This is his, right? 
think so. Winthrop's terminal, yep, this is the room. But he's not in there right now. Where are you, Winthrop? Are you hanging out with Tulip? You are. How's Underworld been treating you so far? What is it now? I think I... Make back the stims that we used in the fight. Oh, that's pretty bad. Probably even less. Oh, we're getting stronger, better, faster. Two levels will have Super Slam, and nothing will stand a chance in a one on one fight. more mutants around this corner. There we go, now I'm finally idolized. Hooray! Because Kurt is... ...and just plot to blow things up like a dick. Oh, that guy. Yeah. He stopped the bomb. Well done.
Where'd the super mutant go that was here? What, the centaurs? Yeah, they're pretty gross. Make it a break for it. Yeah, they're the um, super mutants' pets, as it were. Centaurs. I don't know if they're how they're made. I'm guessing they're just that or uh, FEV. Um, Mutations gone wrong. Look at that punt. Apparently, the game decided that that was a really important punt. You can't hide from me. Centaurs are less exposed to FEV. Oh god. You can't hide from me. I can taste your fear. That does not sound fun. Ugh. There. They appear to be made out of more than one person, at least by count of their parts. Oh man, brain tumor foreshadowing. This guy's all like Caesar seven headed. I know. I know. Poor Caesar. Poor Kaisar. Eh. Don't really have any eh. um, sympathy left for that guy. <laughs> floaters were a type of centaur? I, I, I've seen floaters in Fallout 1. I, I don't remember them that much, but I don't Caesar remember them being be centaurs. I mean, I'm not doubting you, but I just didn't think of them as a type of centaur. Ugh. Or maybe I'm just thinking of, like, the wrong thing. It's been a while since I've played Fallout 1. Cool, it was that one that followed me in. No. as hell. Supermans themselves aren't that pretty, but the textures aren't that great, so... Kind of ignore the fact that they're grotesque monstrosities. They're at least humanoid-ish. Or no, humanoid-ish. Humanoid enough that you can ignore the fact that they're so grotesque.
question is, what did that tripwire control? Because nothing's a solid color. You'll notice, like, some people have just, like, straight up blue on their face. Just blue. Not, like, you know, a slight shade of blue. Like, just blue. There's the coloration in the follow, in follow three is kind of wacky. It's part of like oh realism, I think. It's realistic to have like different shades in the body, which it, it kind of is. Bodies aren't uniformly a single color, but they kind of went overboard, I think. That tripwire triggers an explosion of some kind. I just can't figure out where or how. So I've triggered it before and gotten well, nearly blown the hell up. <laughs> 